Yesterday we have talked about log activity. Like I said, majority of the time we'll have to search for logs in this location. So far we have seen how to add a filter. Okay, both uh, from the contextual menu, also from the uh, add filter button. Okay, sometimes what happens is you want to apply a filter all the time. Let's say I don't want to see this health metric. Not that. I don't want to see this health metric and I don't want to see the information message also. Where is that? There it is. But the problem is if I refresh, the filters will be gone. Okay. Let's say today I'm doing a investigation for that. I don't want to confuse my logs with some other logs. So I applied a filter to avoid some other logs. Let's say four computers are there. I am investigating two computers. So I have avoided the remaining two computers today or now if I just refresh those two filters will be gone. Again, I have to put filters. Okay. So every time I do that, every time it will be gone. So what I can do is I can use the save criteria button in order to keep the filters there until I remove. Okay. First we'll see that for example, as I've shown you, if I have disabled information metrics, sorry, information messages and health metrics. If I just double click refresh filters are gone. So I don't want that to happen. Even after refresh, I want them to be there. Okay. So for that, what I'll do is first you have to add filters. Filter I'll based on event name. Event name equals 